Hello everyone, I am Pyro Falcon and this is Monster Rancher 4. I was a good pyro and listened to my own message from the last episode, so I know what we're doing. I also know we are going to enter this ridiculous tournament gauntlet, so I don't know how much uh, AMA I'm going to be answering for this recording session. Eh, everyone was in the 80s. Okay. No one gets praised or scolded, but y'all could have probably done a little better. Anyway. But, who knows? One thing that I has been surprising me with this run is that the tournaments aren't taking us nearly as long as I thought they would. Which makes sense, honestly, because it's only a few fights and a couple of co uh, cutscenes. Assuming we do well, which we generally have been doing pretty well. So, I suppose it does make some sense that we're tearing through these tournaments pretty quickly. So, I was... I still haven't seen my first run again, but I'm curious how the first run only took 23 episodes to get to the credits, and this one was taking far longer. Someone had pointed out to me that it was probably because I did a bunch of time skipping, and that is true, but it didn't fully occur to me just how much time skipping there was because I do distinctly recall a moment in the first run where I think I had to go to the jungle three times in a row and I time skipped all three and so for me playing that would have been a good three to four hours of total time maybe Maybe not. Maybe just a couple hours. Um, and for you all, it would have been two seconds of a screen wipe, which I'm thinking like an hour and a half is freaking five episodes here. So my point is that does make sense that, you know, just doing heavy time skipping the first time through would have been enough to get me... Uh, would have been enough to get me done very quickly. So, whatever. Uh, this time around, we're not doing so much time skipping. That way I can do AMA questions and the such like that there. And, I don't know. So this will be a longer series, right? And that's okay. Right? <laughs> you're watching it. Hopefully that means you're enjoying it. And hopefully that means you are into the AMA stuff. I've already thought ahead to when we finish the series as well. And how I... Who's fighting? I am interested in doing streams of the game. Um, and during those we can continue AMA stuff that I maybe haven't... Hadn't gotten a chance to do during the course of the actual game. So, yeah man. We got plans. Um, I don't want Monster Ranger 4 to stop anytime soon. Okay, 4 and 5 get praised. And then we'll do a food check. So, not you. You don't get praised. Have these two really not hit their adulthood yet? I'm a little screwed up on how long we've been going, because the last session we did was only four months. Which doesn't seem very long. And I don't think Samara or Aruda are even a year old yet, are they? No, jeez, they're not even- they're only seven months old? Wow, yeah, my- my brain thinks we've been at this a lot longer than we have. I think it's partly the episode count, and it's partly, um, the fact that the, um, the expeditions essentially freeze time. So, you can be on an expedition for 45 minutes to an hour, but you're only having one week pass. And then, I guess, again, combined with the episode count, I'm like, man, we aren't, we aren't going through the time as much as, uh, as fast as I think we are. But that's fine. All of that is fine. It's just an observation of... Uh, chronological movement. I don't know. Fancy words. Hello, Pontus. Damn, you're ugly. Let's kick it, Eva Marie. By kick it, I mean use this magical beam thing. 
That's solid. I, I didn't think I could two hit a color Pandora. They usually have high life and being part Beaklin. Or is that part Hangar? Well, whatever. Decent defense, but still, our girl knows how to win. Eva Marie kicking ass as she always does. And so far, so good. If Eva Marie's previous battles are anything to go by, she will have zero problems in this level of competition. She's probably ready to go up a class now, but we just have to earn our way to it. I have a reverse AMA for all of you since we're playing through these tournaments. So in previous Monster Ranchers, all you had to do was win the official tournament and you'd go up the class. You didn't have to do this three-star system where you have to win three tournaments at a lower level before going up a class. Do you, do you who is listening to this, prefer this three-star system or do you prefer the ability to just jump a class whenever you want? For me, I'm ambivalent, but I think I prefer the three-star system from a from an in-universe perspective, because it doesn't make sense for some random rookie monster to just suddenly be shooting up the ranks and getting title shots. Like, just in real life with boxing and mixed martial arts, you have to win a few times before you're granted a title shot against the champion. You have to prove that you can hang with that class of people. So, I kind of like the system. However, the downside of it is it can make things a little slower to get up there when you have a new monster. But double, however, we haven't seen it here because I don't play it this way, but when you, when you breed a monster then they start at a higher class anyway. So I think the highest class they can start in is the C class here in Monster Rancher 4, but that saves you time. I mean, if you start in the C class, that saves you eight tournaments that you don't have to enter. The three star for the E, and then the official E, and the three star for the D, and the official D. So they're... You know, breeding still gets you that shortcut, especially because when you breed monsters, their numbers are crazy high anyway, comparatively. But, so I don't think it's that big of a time. Now, for me, we haven't seen that because in the first run of this game, we weren't doing a lot of breeding. And so far, of course, here we're not doing breeding yet. But we'll, we'll get there. We will get there. Um, I don't know. I just wondered if you guys prefer it one way or the other. Uh, it's like most things with mechanics and games. I don't... Uh, although I prefer this three-star system, I recognize it takes longer. Uh, this would definitely be kind of a... Uh, kind of a killer for speedrunners. But also, it might get annoying over the course of a really long game. Um, you know, I don't know. I like... Okay, you're down to two focus. You... Why are you frustrated? But, you know what? Fine, you three just get rest, because I don't want to deal with you. I don't want to deal with your nonsense today. Okay, one gets praised. Wow, even after a tournament. One gets praised, and then a food check. Yeah, let's get that speed up. I don't even know what her speed number is. I'm going to keep her speed going until she gets up a class, and we can reevaluate her from there. But this way she will hopefully not get the crap kicked out of her once she gets there. So, yeah, man. And then there's <laughs> Eva, which doesn't even have tournaments. That's just, that's just silly. Um, but it's fine. I like Evo very much so. So, I, I'm continuing to think what I'm going to do with Monster Rancher after we finish our adventure here. If I'll do an all-something run on Evo. Because that does sound like fun. It wouldn't be all pixies, though, because now we've done that gimmick once. Um, but, I don't know. We'll see. We'll, we'll see what happens. And I don't mean to try to be, you know, a, a reality... TV host but, and a hype man by being, we'll see. Stay tuned in, we'll see. 
just... I don't know. <laughs> I never know what I'm doing. Minute to minute with the show. Alright, I'm gonna buy some stuff. One moment. There we go. I probably just did the fade on the loading screen to a loading screen, so that probably didn't look like I did anything, but I bought a bunch of stuff. Hello, any problems with your training gadgets? What will you do? Uh, do you sell anything else? I still don't have any medallions. Oh, oh, wait a minute. I've got a bunch of, um, things now. Yeah, look at all this stuff. I've got a bunch of crap. Yes, intelligence tablet. Uh, Stonehenge. Cool. Uh-huh. Moving target. Cool. Those are better. Thunder Mac. Awesome. What are the old tablets do? It's called a rock. Swift, I'm really glad that the pra that the appraisals are free because I would hit you with that rock if you tried to charge me a thousand bucks for doing that. What else we got here? Okay, we did that one. And you've done that one. Okay, that's fine. Um, so what the hell's a rock? Let's see. Rock, power. Ugh. Power up at the cost of defense. See, I don't like the... I don't like the ones that have a downside. I mean, I know that... They're generally better, but... Yeah, I don't... I really don't like something that costs me accuracy. Um, but that's not... I mean, it's not a huge deal. Like, some of these, it's it's arguably worth it. Like, the, the moving target is arguably worth it. Because even though speed takes a hit, we can get that up pretty damn quickly. To counteract the problem. Um... Not that I have the m money for any of this right now, but it's something to think about. Wait, how much would it be? Yeah, eight grand. I can't even afford it anymore. And then the effect ones, I don't have any. Cool. All right. All right, thanks, Swift. I, I can't really do much now, but once we start getting more and more cash, we'll be all right. Okay, Eva Marie, you look a little sleepy. Whoops. Who's fighting today? Ash Girl. All right, Ash Girl, you get to rest. Uh, Macbeth, you're working on your accuracy. Aruda, you are working on your speed. And Samara, you are working on your speed. All right. Have at it, ladies. You have your orders. Praise five, and then a food check. I guess I should check them, too. Because... One of them I was waiting to get to 200, and I can't remember what I was doing with the other one. Samara and Aruda. Uh... Okay, I think I was trying to get Samara to 200. No, I think I was getting Samara to 250 and Aruda to 200. Maybe. God, their numbers are so similar. Um, tell you what, just keep working at it. We'll reevaluate when you get into a fight. Alright, then Eva, have a, uh, uh, a, uh, a butt peach. Because I think it's more filling than a mango. Nom nom. Yum yum. Peachy peachy. I got some frozen fruits that I still need to get into. They're intended for smoothies, but I don't like smoothies. I just want to eat some fruit. <laughs> it sounds fantastic. All right, Ash Girl. Let's do it. I almost said I have faith in her, but that would be a lie. <laughs> I don't think she's going to lose. I just don't have that much faith in her right now. So we'll see what happens. Ugh, that's another phrase I'm trying to get out of my lexicon. The whole, we'll see what happens. Alright, uh, okay, so we've got her intelligence up. That's what we've been working on. Get away from me. That's Starlight. 87% chance to hit is still so. Oh, okay! 
Yeah, alright. I think we're fine now. 87% chance to hit is still solid. I don't have to grow the pixies the exact same way. If we graze Ash Girl to just be a heavy hitter, then so it goes. Alright, that's a good sign. So all I have to do is beat Holiday, and we've got this in the bag. I like this gameplay flow, that we're heavy on expeditions, and then we're heavy on... tournaments. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, and then... You know, heavy on plot, repeat. I just, I don't know, I like it. It's It gives us a little bit of variety. Especially for the show, because then you aren't seeing nothing but tournaments for five weeks in a row, followed by nothing but plot for five weeks in a row. Ugh, mojis. Go away. Alright, um, so that takes care of you... Let's actually look at the calendar now. Yeah, so Eva needs her third match. Ash Girl is, and Macbeth are ready to go up. Yeah, so Ash Girl won't be able to go up until then. Oof. Samara doesn't need it, but Aruta does. That's why we're doing that. And then Aruta will do that one, and then that... And then Macbeth will be here and probably will need this one. And this one. Okay, so after this week, correction, after October 4, then we can start doing some more futzing. Alright, cool. Alright, uh, continue to work on what you are working on, ladies. Uh, you've got the this. Wait a minute. No, you don't. And who's fighting? Wait a minute. God damn it. Ugh. Constantly forgetting what I'm doing here. Aruda and Samara. Four and five. Okay, so four and five get rest this week. Let's just do that now before I forget. Alright, so these two. Mm -hmm. You have enough. You can do that. Yep. Alright. Uh, you have your orders. Ooh, two and three get scolded. Those are naughty ladies. Don't be slacking off here. I don't care if you're tired. You can do your hand fists all you want. I'm tired of your mouth there, Macbeth. I mean, Ash Girl. Although, I'm t <laughs> you can do better too, Macbeth. Whoops. I didn't mean to give her a salmon, but that's fine. I don't fully regret it either. Alright, and then... Were you hungry? Yeah, you could probably eat. Have a something small. Have a squid. Okay, I just realized I'm being kind of bad to my body today because I have a stream to do in two hours. So I'm going to try to cram in a full recording session and then also stream for two and a half hours. Because that's what healthy people do. Of course, that said, I mean, my longest stream has been 22 hours before because I was an idiot. So we, uh, 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 I'm looking at the clock. Um... So really, this isn't going to stress my throat too bad. I've done a lot worse to myself. All right, tag match. And this is all for Aruda, since she only has a single star. We will get her her second star here, provided we win. But we should, because it's been... We've been dominating the E-class with Aruda and Samara, so we should be fine. Oh, God. That kind of came out of nowhere. That's the interesting thing about Tigers. Um, the AI doesn't seem to care about how quick an attack comes out, but it, if you were fi facing another player, they probably wouldn't have enough time to counter that because the animation happens too quickly. 
All right, so that's going to do it for today. We'll finish up this tournament in the next one and continue our gauntlet from there. Try to get the ladies built up, and hopefully they will be in a position of strength very soon. Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you again tomorrow for another episode.